Hello, my name is Dave Mahalik. I'm an engineer here at Fort Defiance Industries, and today we're going to talk about the controls and indicators of the water softener. Um, so, we got the vessel here that has a bunch of resin beads inside it um, that is actually, you know, pulling out the the calcium um, before it sends the water to the water recovery system. And right here we have the um, the inlet garden hose connection. And so if you have um, a pressurized water system, you know, you're just going to connect your water hose right here. And then on this side, we have the outlet um, hose connection. It's also just a garden hose. Um, this can be connected and disconnected by hand. And then on this end, um, I mentioned earlier on the water recovery system, that has a cam and groove fitting. And here's that corresponding female cam and groove fitting. So, um, still have a little valve right here to turn it on and off and um, you're just going to insert this onto the wire recovery system and use the little levers to lock the camera groove fitting in. Um, that's everything on the front. I'm gonna, oh, we also have the, the cap. This cap right here, you can unscrew it um, and if you're regenerating it, which we will talk about later, if you're regenerating it, you're going to want to unscrew unscrew this cap to have access to the beads on the inside of this vessel. So here around the back, um, if you don't have pressurized water, um, and if you have some jerry cans, again, you've got to use potable water. But if, if you have jerry cans with potable water, you're going to use this um, inlet strainer hose um, in the jerry can. Uh, again, just a garden hose connection here um, to easily connect and disconnect. Um, and you're going to use the manual pump, uh, just pump this clockwise. And so we got the suction side, the discharge side. You're going to use this little hose supply to connect to the inlet of the vessel. Um, again, it's just a little hose, garden hose connection. Um, and you're just going to use this to uh, uh, manually pump water through the softener into the water recovery system. And I believe that's all for the water softener.